Hello, this is Landon from Design Visionaries, and in this video I'd like to show you how to sew a set an enclosed sheet body into one body while retaining it as a sheet body. Now normally, when you select the sew command and you have a closed body such as this, and you select all the bodies together and hit OK, you'll notice that it says solid body created. Um, and you can double check this by turning the timestamp order off and see that there is a solid body here now. Um, so there are many times when you need to sew sheets together, but you want to maintain the fact that it, it is a sheet body and not a solid body. Let's turn timestamp back on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to control Z that sew. And there's two ways to do this. Um, the easiest one is to just simply go to sew and select the sheet body uh, tool or target and then all but one of the sheet bodies so just keep one out like so hit OK and then go back and edit that and then select tool and select that and it should maintain a sheet body so this forces it to stay as a sheet body because that was the output that happened when you lacked to, or when you didn't um, include that one sheet. But when you go back and edit it and add it back in, it still stays as a sheet body. Now, a lot of you might not like doing it that way because it feels like you're kind of hacking the system to do it that way. So uh, let's show you the other way to do it. The other way to do it is to simply go to File, uh, Preferences under Modeling. And right here under the uh, General Modeling Preferences, you'll see Body Type. This is what it always wants to default to as a solid when doing uh, operations like uh, extrudes and, and sews and stuff. You notice that uh, the default is usually a solid. So you can change that to sheet and hit OK. And now when I go to sew, and it can select all the bodies and hit OK, sheet body was created. And just to verify, we'll turn off timestamp order and see that we only have a sheet body. And then you can just as easily, oops, let me uh, turn that back on. You can just as easily go back into preferences and click it back on when you're done. And this way you can generate a uh, enclosed sheet body from sewing. Again, this is Landon Ritchie from Design Visionaries. And this is how to sew uh, sheet bodies in, into a sheet rather than a solid. Uh, for more tips, tricks, and tutorials like this, Please check us out on the web at designvisionaries.com uh, and you can also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.